Mrs. Good morning. Yes, good morning. How are you? Yes, I am good. What about you, sir? Yes, I'm. I am also doing fine. Actually, but I, I, I want to share you something that when, when uh, it is the case of keep uh, meeting with Saraswati Madam, then mm -hmm. it comes to my mind that yes, uh, I am going to learn something because the Saraswati is the name of the goddess of knowledge. So, <laughs> so I, I feel that yes, that today I am going to gain some knowledge from the Saraswati Madam. <laughs> Ooh. But uh, my name is Saraswati only. I am not goddess. Thank you for <laughs> no, no. Actually, I'm <laughs> just cutting the joke because the Saraswati is the goddess of knowledge. So yes. that is. Oh, you know, yeah, this name is given by my father when uh, that time he cleared one, uh, you know, competitive examination. And okay. uh, result was declared at that time. So he got the seventh rank in that. So because of okay. that, uh, he keep my name Saraswati. Oh, oh yes, yes, yeah. yes, that was that was a great, great moment because uh, because our dad was so happy during that time because of clearing the examination successfully and uh, that time you you were also born. Yeah, so, I was born at so, that time. Yeah. Uh, yes, yes. I also I also share with you one of the experience my when my daughter was born during that time I was cleared one examination because mm. uh, because she is a she, she is also like a Lakshmi to me mm. so so that is why yes yes uh, yeah it is always believed that uh, baby girls are really Lakshmi and Saraswati to their fathers mm, yes. yes. I do, I do accept it, yeah, and I do always agree that baby girls are really, really much more attractive than the uh, baby boys. Yes. So, uh, so yes, madam, uh, this is the third session with you. So, uh, so I just like to know how do you enjoy the sessions? How do you enjoy the sessions when uh, when you just uh, but but doing the how how do you the same how do you enjoy the sessions with me? Just uh, yes, you, sir, my are, experience are is you good because, happy? because you know you are very knowledgeable person and experienced person. So I okay. I am when I connect with you, so definitely I will learn something new. This is no yeah, no no. That no. is very we, important thing for me. No, actually not. I am. Uh, I am uh, so much knowledge. Actually, one call has came. I just uh, disconnected, declined the call because of this. Uh, the problem has happened. Uh, one one call came from came from my office. Okay. Uh, so yeah. yes. So yes, I am not uh, that yet uh, a knowledgeable person. Just so what you are. Uh, because you uh, speak in your day to day life, so you no, already no, no, know English. Uh, well, actually, what happens? Uh, uh, actually, we are not. I am not required to speak English uh, every day. So, okay. so that is why my fluency is not up to the satisfactory level. So, if mm -hmm. uh, if I if I get the opportunity to speak English every day, then then my uh, English fluency uh, will be uh, uh, would be to that at the satisfactory level. But I think that uh, it is not because of the lack of exposure to our English knowledge, our fluency level. Because in our Calcutta, it is uh, it is not uh, not the environment. The environment is not like that. The every person is speaking uh, yeah, English uh, with the other persons because in our yeah. office it is it is not a practice to speak with our colleagues, with our uh, subordinates, with our superiors uh, in uh, mm -hmm. English. But but sometimes when the superiors come from the uh, different state, suppose they are mm -hmm. coming from the Andhra Pradesh or some South India or the northern part of the India or western part of the India, that time. Uh, we do uh, we do a, a bit conversation in the English languages uh, only with them, but uh, but maximum maximum in our uh, in in our state because uh, almost all the people uh, in in our office are uh, they are from Bengal, so uh, we do we do converse with ourselves uh, of uh, uh, most of the times in a day most of the most of, almost all. All of the times in a day in the regional languages only. So I think that 
it is it is a, it is the language madam uh, as per my presumption it is the language which we have to talk more uh, yes. because it is a language so much we talk the better our fluency become so yes. so that is why that is why i i, I am also in a effort to uh, uh, polish my uh, english language is nowadays so that is why i am just connecting with the co speakers Sir, you do not do any grammatical mistakes. I think so. Uh, actually, I am not. Uh, uh, yes, uh, during the flow of conversation, sometimes grammatical mistakes may happen. But yeah. uh, but but when we I go to write English, then that time uh, I do not generally commit the grammatical mistake because mm -hmm. that time I get some time to think over my sentences, mm -hmm. think over my uh, conceptions. I think over the at that time uh, yeah, it becomes easy. Uh, and and when I go to speak, that requires the instant uh, sentence construction capability. So that time, sometimes uh, I do commit mistakes, but uh, generally I do try to uh, uh, to keep the mistakes less. But yes, uh, mm -hmm. during the flow of conversation, sometimes one or two mistakes or three or five mistakes may happen. Mm -hmm. so, I think because of that, you know, you speak, you are speaking correct English because uh, you um, so have the habit of uh, writing some letters, some mail. Yes, 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 yeah. yes. yes, yes. That 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 I do write every day because uh, if I do not write any letter notes, then uh, we have to write. I have to write the uh, uh, over WhatsApp also, uh, mm -hmm. because in our office uh, we are uh, we have a WhatsApp group through which we communicate with our other colleagues or or the other state officers. So but that, that we do have to write uh, in the WhatsApp uh, uh, on re regular basis. That uh, yes, yes, yes. Uh, this is a, uh, actually I think that la learning is a never-ending process. Uh, it is a it is a process which is to be continued throughout the life. Yes. There is no no age restrictions. I think that uh, anyone can learn that anything at any uh, point of time at his life. Yes. Yes. So, so I think we should stop with that. Uh, we should start with the topic. Yes, 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 yes. Why not? Why not? So what topic are we are going to discuss today? Uh, today's topic is nature. Nature, yes, yes, yes. Nature, nature. Uh, yesterday, uh, the uh, yeah, on our uh, on our uh, previous day, uh, uh, we uh, uh, yeah, over here. Yeah, which topic uh, did we yet uh, discuss? Friendship. Friendship. Okay, okay, okay. Now, yes. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Yes, madam. Yes, madam. We can. So, you first. Uh, you first start uh, because I think that you have. Uh, you are. You have taken the preparation. You have done the preparation about the nature. So you are looking very confident. I. I have not. <laughs> done that now you start. Uh, I listen. <laughs> you start, madam. Okay. Uh, nature. You know, nature is all around us. Wherever we see, we find nature everywhere. Uh, it uh, includes like uh, uh, high mountains to the uh, teeny uh, grass. Uh, it is the process. Uh, it is you know. Uh, it, uh, it is one of the you know testament testament of the what we say uh, cre creation of God and the power of God. Yes, yes. And one of the most uh, uh, overwhelming aspect is diversity. Because in yes. nature there is lots of diversity, uh, yes. like you know, uh, from the um, rainfall of the uh, Amazon to the barren desert of Sahara, uh, each has their unique uh, ecosystem. Yes, yes, yes. And you can that is you know teeming with life. So wherever we see. We find that everywhere is, you know, a variety and uh, there is a lots of uh, wonders in nature we found. But uh, apart from this, nature is also harmony and balance. Like uh, every plants, animals and microorganisms have their own important to keep the balance of ecosystem. 
Yes. And this uh, uh, nature is also, you know, has the power of healing power, we can say. Uh, like physical as well as emotional also. When we spend uh, lots of time in nature, so our uh, stress level can reduce. And uh, not only stress level, lots of disease can uh, reduce when we uh, spend lots of time in nature. Like when we go for morning walk, uh, are we hiking in the mountains? So we find like, you know, the sights, the sounds, uh, all, uh, you know, calm our body as well as mind also. But despite its wonders, there is nature is also very fragile and vulnerable. Like, you know, many activities of humans, uh, like, uh, you know, uh, deforestation and uh, pollution. And after that, uh, uh, um, what we say, our uh, changing uh, atmosphere, because nowadays atmosphere is changing day by day. So, uh, it, uh, you know, uh, because we are destroying our nature day by, by cutting trees as deforestation. So our uh, ecosystem is also affected. But uh, there are still some possibility. We can save our nature by doing, uh, you know, uh, planting more trees. And uh, like government also uh, pass many, you know, uh, rules and uh, uh, I'm not getting the proper word. Rules and regulations. The, the regulations we, yes. yes, follow all the, these rules and regulations so we can save our nature. Yes, yes, yes. You are you are at absolutely true, uh, true, madam. Because nature constitutes the whole universe. It is uh, it is our whole world. Uh, the nature and uh, nature is according to me. The nature is having the uh, living animals and the non-living animals. Yes. Nature constitutes the living animals. One part is the living animals, and the one part is the non-living animals. In the uh, in terms of the living animals, human being uh, is a superior species, and uh, and and apart from the human being, there are other living uh, animals, are the wild animals, uh, sea uh, sea creatures, uh, and uh, and uh, and the birds, all these things. Mm -hmm. So, so, uh, and 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 uh, in case of the non-living things, uh, uh, in the uh, the nature, these are the air, water, mountain. Uh, so all these things. So human beings are taking the resources to live their life from the nature, because uh, yeah. we the we the human being drink the water, we the human being uh, breathe the oxygen from the air. Uh, we the human being uh, are taking the greens from the trees. Uh, so, so it is our duty to protect our nature. So yeah. this thing is not being happening because every day the nature uh, nature is being uh, uh, is being jeopardized. I think that uh, the, we are not taking the proper care to save our nature because the uh, the tree felling is happening uh, yeah at an increasing rate. Because of the because of the increasing population rate, the, uh, yeah. because nowadays nowadays what uh, uh, I can say, uh, the India is the number one number one populous country uh, uh, in the in the whole world. It has uh, it has uh, it has the overtaken the China in terms of population nowadays. So in order to in order to provide the uh, accommodation. To the increasing number of the population, uh, th uh, there there happens the tree felling, the deforestation, deforestation yes. because because all the forest areas or all the greeneries, all the open lands are now being converted to the high rises. Uh, yes. So so high rise buildings and high rises. So uh, this is happening. This is also also endangering endangering our nature so because uh, these are either destroying the nature because uh, the ecological balance is being hampered in this way uh, uh, so the and 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 one more thing is the uh, because of the increasing of the populations the 
air pollutions are also also uh, also happening air pollutions are also uh, uh, also uh, air, uh, are uh, air pollutions also are taking place because yeah because increasing the, day by day uh, increasing day by day yes yes this is the uh, yeah, right word the air pollution is also increasing day by day because the number of vehicles are also uh, the yeah, hitting the roads more uh, uh, we can see that uh, each and every day the our roads are uh, the, the the vehicles are also increasing because the because of the number of populations are yeah increasing and the vehicles are also increasing because uh, these are uh, uh, direct relation so yes uh, and, and and because of the increasing of, of uh, a yeah, number of vehicles the air pollutions are also uh, also uh, being happening at um, uh, at uh, in more so it uh, it is i think that uh, we should have to uh, it is a high time uh, we should have to think over the uh, think over the issue how do we can save our nature how do uh, we have to uh, keep our nature uh, more protected so that uh, uh, no more tree felling is happening because uh, because much the tree felling or much deforestation will happen then uh, it will cause the deficiency of the oxygens in our nature and 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 that will in turn uh, endanger uh, endanger the life of the human beings not only the human beings uh, the other animals also also the sea animals, the the wild animals in the forest. Uh, so uh, yes, uh, nature is a, a very precious thing, uh, which uh, we are not taking care. Uh, we are not uh, taking the right care of the nature. So uh, I think that uh, we uh, we we all should uh, not uh, uh, the all over the world. All there, uh, there is. Uh, I think that uh, one one day is being observed uh, as a, a nature day or tree plant, uh, plantation day uh, all over the world. Suppose there yes. is uh, one day, so I think that uh, we should have to plant more trees. We should not uh, destroy the uh, our forest. Uh, we should not destroy the green green fields uh, for the sake of the building of the high rises. So and add one one uh, the, the the one most thing what the India government has to take care that is to control the population because mm -hmm. uh, because unless and until they are not uh, they are not taking care to control the population the tree felling and the deforestation will continue to happen. This is this is my idea whatever uh, came to my mind I just try to explain it. But I I am not sure that how well I have described myself. But yes, this is yes, the situation. Yes, because you know uh, we just uh, discuss these topics. But in real life, do we follow all these things? No, no, that is not question. at all. Not at all. We are just we are just saying uh, we are just uh, telling or speaking whatever is coming to my yeah. mind. Everyone everyone knows. Every, Everyone knows that uh, it is our duty. It is everyone's responsibility. Not is not it is the only duty of the government of India. It is the duty of the every public in the India or all over the world to uh, to do something which can take care, which uh, uh, which can take care of the nature or 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 which protects the nature. So yes. uh, so we uh, we have to plant more trees. Uh, we do take care of uh, control. Uh, uh, we do take care of the uh, environmental pollutions also, uh, so yes. that uh, uh, so that all the vehicles uh, which are uh, which are more than 15 years old, that sh that vehicle should be banned. Uh, these uh, these uh, these are the regulatory uh, things. Uh, I think that the government has to put in place. Uh, yes. Otherwise, and if you only use uh, one vehicle in one family. If we decide yes. these things with ourselves only, because uh, not every time government, uh, we should, um, we can't blame our government. No, yes, 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 right, right, right. Yeah. That is why I am telling that uh, it is not the duty of the government only. It is the, it is a responsibility of the each and every public of India. Yes. And 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 government has to, government has to uh, uh, take care. Government has to take care, or government has to ensure. That the everything are are in uh, are uh, are in proper place. 
so everything uh, is being happening at a timely manner i i i also uh, i uh, i also see i i have seen that the vehicles which are which are uh, uh, surely 20 years old uh, or or over that but that that vehicles are also flying on the road and government of india is totally uh, totally uh, inactive and silent over that issue if these vehicles hit the road more and more then then the more and more air pollution will happen because the the, the carbon dioxide or the carbon monoxide what the what that vehicle is uh, uh, emanating that uh, uh, that will generally uh, will definitely uh, cause the harm of the uh, air Yes. Yeah. Even you know, uh, like uh, for uh, like uh, when we just saying all these things, like we should plant more trees and uh, we should uh, uh, less we should use less vehicles, but we do not follow these things activity in our own life. Yes, yes, yes. This thing, yes, yes. we do not uh, follow because uh, because uh, we uh, we are not we are not uh, doing our duties properly because we are no. not we are we we are thinking that it is the duty and responsibility of the government of India. So so I think the public should be educated. The public should be educated and public should be make more uh, sensitive uh, to these issues. You know, because I was uh, talking one time through this application only, and that guy was uh, doing his NDA, preparing for NDA examination. He told me, uh, he was very intelligent actually. He told me if 10% of people started to plant trees, so this problem can reduce. Yes, 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 yes. It is, it is absolutely true. But one thing also, I can also say that uh, the the lands, the lands, the number of lands uh, are being squeezed day by day. So, so yes, uh, 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 if we do not find any field or any land, what do uh, where do we plant these trees? It is the it is the thing. It is the it is the duty of the government of India, first and foremost duty, to contain the population of the India. A contain because because the population is being increasing at an alarming rate. Each and mm -hmm. every day, the population sir. It is uh, it is not that uh, uh, that uh, uh, nowadays the every every family is concerned to keep their family short. Uh, just just every family uh, knows that they 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 have to keep their family a nuclear family just three or four people so and the, and and the main factor to increase the population is the infiltration infiltration is happening from the neighboring countries the each and every day uh, uh, we uh, uh, yeah, we can see that the uh, infiltration is happening from the neighboring countries like Bangladesh, Nepal, Bhutan, China, Pakistan. The corruption in the in the India is uh, at a high level. I think that in comparison to the other countries, the corruption, the Indian Indian uh, the, uh, ministry, Indian ministry is uh, highly involved in the uh, uh, corruption. Each and every day, you will find uh, if you if you open the newspaper that the ED is running after uh, that minister. ED is running after that minister. To, uh, they are investigating their assets. They are investigating their properties. So yes, uh, this thing has yes, been because been. you know if a government uh, uh, do his duty well and uh, whatever rule uh, they make. And we, if we follow these rules strictly, so these problems will not happen. And very soon we can overcome through this problem. Yes, yes, yes. You are, you are absolutely true. You are absolutely true. So yes, let us see what will happen uh, when, uh, when our uh, the Indian government will be uh, will become more sensitive. So yeah. uh, it will take uh, at a, at another. 40 to 50 years. Uh, so I think we discussed, uh, we covered lots uh, of topics related lots to of nature. Topics.
Uh, yes, 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 yes. Uh, we have uh, we have uh, yeah, discussed almost all the things of the topic uh, and and covered covered all the things in our uh, discussion uh, as per our uh, ability. So yes, yeah. uh, which we are used to. So yes, yeah. uh, we we have to practice more. So let us see when the fluency comes. And uh, I I surely believe that fluency will definitely come. And uh, and and uh, yeah, it will not happen uh, yeah, within an overnight. It will happen gradually. Okay. Yes. Thank you for giving a precious time, sir. Thank you. Thank yes. you. Thank you, madam. Thank you.